Welcome to Happy Healthy Living with Yvonne Douglas. I'm Doug and today we're going to do some kitchen organization, so stay tuned. Okay, so we're gonna go to the container store and pick up some containers <laughs> for the kitchen drawers. We're gonna be working on some kitchen organization, so stay tuned. Okay, well, the container store's not open yet. I thought they opened up at nine, and they open up at 10. So let me check out Home Goods. Okay, so the container store wasn't open yet, so like I said, I went to Home Goods. And I found a couple of things at Home Goods, so I'm going to be showing you that in just a second. But I did want to show you my special find. My special find, which is this Ray Dunn OJ pitcher with a little orange juice squeezer. And I thought that was so awesome. You know, you squeeze the orange juice and then you have the juice in there and it pours. It has the pouring spout and it was on sale for $8. So I couldn't resist it when I saw it. Yes. So really excited about my little find there. And uh, something else that I really like this, I bought at actually at the um, container store a while back, I believe it was the container store. And this anti-slip it says anti-slip rug grips. Um, it's for rugs, but I actually used it at the bottom of some of my containers for the drawers so they don't go sliding all over the place. So let's, uh, let me show you what I did today. Okay, so the very first thing that I wanna show you is I got this bamboo organizer. This was at Home Goods. It was only $9.99, which I thought was a good price for that. And that, um, those grips there, those rug grips that, you know, I put at the bottom of these, notice that these don't move. All right, so it just stays in its, and uh, you could always remove it if you need to, but for right now it's staying in place. I do have my small spoons and my uh, large dinner forks that are gonna go here in the dishwasher, so. Um, but I love this organization, has a place for everything. These are just extras on the side here extra serving spoons and stuff, so I just placed it there. Um, this is another one with some more, and uh, same thing, a little extra space on the side for these little corn holders, extra chopsticks that I just acquired, and then I got some steak knives here, and, and so a nice little organi organization there. And this drawer is like my messy drawer kind of thing, but it has just odds and ends like measuring cups and things like that. So um, it's really, I'm just throwing it in here for now. It's not exactly how I want to keep it, but for now it's okay. And then this one is pretty much my baking stuff, but notice these organizers, how nice everything is in its place for some of my, um, when I do some decorating, cake decorating, or cupcakes, all my different tips, and spatulas, and things like that. Now in this cabinet, this tub, I have a tub here, and I have all my cookie cutters. I just placed all my cookie cutters in here, and it just slides right in there. 
along with some baking things. So that is in this cabinet right here. Down here, this, this little drawer unit, I have my cookie sheets and my sill pad and some, uh, <laughs> that's actually for Halloween skull molds to uh, bake in or cook in. So that's where I keep all that stuff down here underneath my oven. And this, this drawer right here, I have just like um, some things for my bunuelos. Um, they make these different pattern star uh, patterns or snowflake patterns here. This is a star. And just meat thermometers, just little odds and ends. It's got some um, cotton twine here and just little odds and ends right in this drawer. Now on my counter, I love having these containers because it's just easy access for everything. So my spatulas, my whisks, my uh, strainers, a um, bunch of different things here. So I love having that there. I got another one here with my wooden spoons and some more, um, just like different things, spatulas, slotted spoon, tongs. Super important to have all your uh, cooking supplies, easy access, so when I'm cooking, it's right there. And of course, I got my knives right there. Now I organized all these drawers here with these organizers. Once again, it has a little grip at the bottom so it doesn't move around. And I just love how this looks. And all, all these drawers right here, same thing, I have some scissors there, some tools, tape, more supplies here, pads, measuring tape. This is where I keep my dish towels in here, my, especially my holiday ones. <laughs> my, my wooden boards are here. I just keep them all in this drawer here. And all these drawers I wipe down with some Clorox rags. And these are more containers. You would not believe how much change I had. I'm gonna show you in just a second all the change I found in these drawers. Can you believe I found all, <laughs> all this change in my drawers? I was like, oh my gosh, I wonder how much money is here. But I guess we'll soon find out. Here's some more drawer organizations, just little glue sticks, flashlights, you know, odds and ends. Same thing with these two. A lot of pencils, pens, those kinds of things. So in this cabinet, I keep all my dishes here and I have some dishes in the dishwasher, but um, really it holds a lot of dishes, these cabinets. I have a lot of cabinet space in this kitchen, which I really love. Um, these are a lot of my Ray Dunn holiday things. And uh, yeah, that's where I keep that. Cups and mugs and glasses all go on in this cabinet here. And uh, that's really it. I got my 4th of July ready, my decor. Uh, this cabinet here is where I keep a lot of, you know, the coffee. It's sort of like my coffee bar area, tea, um, odds and ends, like some chips and cookies down there. Um, but as you can see, I have a lot of cabinets for storage down there. It's really the dog supplies. And then this starts the cleaning supplies all down in here underneath the sink. The island right here is where underneath the, here in the cabinets, I keep all my bowls, my um, food, a lot of my uh, rice cookers and things like that, blenders and um, mixers. Same thing over here. My bowls, lot, lots of bowls here. And my bunt, uh, bunt molds, that kind of stuff. Now, one of the purchases we made last year was this. I love this china closet in our breakfast room. It looks kind of like a little bit on the countryside, which I really love, French country. But that's where I proudly display my parents' uh, German Hutchenreuter uh, dishes. And I uh, keep that out when it's not holiday time. So Christmas time, this will have a lot of Christmas stuff. Halloween will have a lot of Halloween stuff. But during the rest of the year, 
Um, I usually keep these dishes out. You know, I will decorate for Valentine's Day and Easter too, but usually these dishes are pretty much here throughout the year. That's what I've been doing all this time. And of course, during the holiday time, I decorate up there. I take those down and switch that out. But I love these drawers. Uh, this drawer here it holds my um, my uh, dinner silverware here. Has this cloth to cover it, which I really like. That came with it. Let's see how nice. And that's for my holiday silverware. My dishes are down here. My holiday dishes and the rest of the German Hutchenreuter dishes. So lots of storage down there, which I really, really love. And yes, Winston, you'll be coming out of your crate pretty soon. I just have to keep you in there while I film. Okay, hold on. I'll let you out in a second. <laughs> and in this cabinet is where I keep all my spices. As you can see, I have a lot of spices in there. And I do have this little stand here to keep them on, but as you can see, I had to double up a little bit, but that's basically where all my spices go. Up there, I keep my candles, some decorative things up in those little cabinets up there. And then there's some more baking stuff in here. Um, more, once again, storage down here and down in here for my strainers. And then in this drawer, I have, um, like can openers and things like that. Yep. So really, no matter what size your kitchen is, you can always try to create your ideal kitchen and what works best for you. So organizers, I highly suggest organizers for drawers. It keeps everything in its place, makes it look good. Um, make sure you have a purpose for all of your cabinets and all your drawers. Um, whether if it's even a, drunk, a junk drawer, you know, that's still a purpose. Let's face it, everybody has a junk drawer. And so, but it's good to also organize that. And then of course, where your dishes go, your glasses, all those important things, your pots and pans, super important. Um, so you can create your own ideal kitchen no matter what size it is and uh, make it work best for you. Thank you so much for joining us on Happy Healthy Living with Yvonne Douglas today. Remember, if you want that homey vibe, you need to subscribe and please give this video a like. Until next time, my friends, happy healthy living. Bye-bye.